Hey guys, I'm Scott from Clam Outdoors and I'm with Kristen Merwin. And today we're going to show you how to set up a hub shack, how easy they are to set up and take down and then we're going to walk through the rest of them. But the first thing I'm going to show you is, is if you're in a windy situation, the first thing you're going to want to do is put in an anchor and I'm going to show you how easy that is. I like to kick the snow out so I can actually get this down to the ice. I like to angle it a little bit away from where I'm gonna. It's just that easy with the tool here. I usually give it a couple spins. And then I always face this gap away from where the house is gonna be. That way the strap can't slip out. We're gonna go over here and pull this one out of the bag here, which you can see is pretty simple. And we're going to show you how to set it up with two men. You can also do this by yourself pretty simply. Basically, you're going to get the hub shack flattened out like this. And Kristen's going to get on the opposite side of me over there. And she'll grab that, that pole. And we'll just pull it really apart. Then we'll, we'll both switch sides. Go to the opposite side. And she'll get on the other end and we'll pull right at the same time. Next part's pretty simple. Just come in the door here and push the top up. And last and final part is when you come in here and you just push the ceiling up. And then we go ahead and set our strap out there so it can't fly away. And um, you're ready to fish. Start drilling holes and get after it. Now that we have the shack up, I have Scott inside and he's holding on to the shack while I come and secure it to the tie down. So if you're just getting this for the first time and you're getting your shack out on the ice, you will need to attach right here this string that comes with it. You just simply come down to the tie down, take this plastic piece and cinch it all the way up until tight. And now, your shack is secure from the wind. So right now we're going to talk about some features that both the X-Series and C-Series have. One of them is this air vent. you got to keep that airflow to get the carbon monoxide out so your heaters will stay lit. Um, we also have the, the window covers to where you can um, black out if you want like a dark house. This is a black house. So you'd um, use this one for sight fishing. The other thing that Clam has made is for the super windy days. we got straps in all four corners and they're pretty easy to put in i'm going to show you real quick how you do it and um usually what i do is i'll pull this strap off here see how it's got that little ring in there then i'll just take this push it down to the to the ice get that down in there and then all you do is pull this up pull the clip over and clip it and then you can just tighten it up and that'll keep your four corners down to where you don't blow away. All right, now we're gonna go out and we're, we got a few more shacks set up, the C-Series and X-Series, and we're gonna show you the different features with each one of those. Now that we have set up our, and given you an example of how to set up the hub, even in windy conditions, now I'm going to break down the Clam Hub C-Series for you. Now, the C-Series comes in two options. It becomes in thermal, or it comes in non-thermal. Now, when considering what you're gonna buy, what you wanna remember with the non-thermal is it's not gonna hold heat as well, but it's also going to be lighter and it's gonna be a little bit less expensive. Where the thermal is was gonna hold heat much better for you, and, but it is gonna be heavier. So that you'll take, wanna take those into consideration when you go to purchase your C-Series hub. We'll, we'll talk here about the thermal. The thermal has 600 denier fabric with 60 grams of insulation per square meter. And it's gonna keep you and your family really warm. It's, there's got a lot of space in this 720. Let's go in and check it out. As you can see, we have a lot of square footage in this C-Series thermal. And some of the great features in this is we have triple uh, quarter pockets here that keep um, the, the fabric secure and safe. We also have this great 
net to put up our jackets because we're going to be so warm our hats our mittens or anything else even food can go up here and then as you can see throughout the shelter we have these gear pockets where we can put in jig boxes or anything else uh, to get it up off the ice the other nice factor is if we want to cut down the light we can certainly close the windows and then of course we have our air vents here to get air through here and keep our heaters running because they they do need fresh oxygen as we stay warm in our shelters. Some of the other important features that are really critical to understand about the C-Series is that we have 11 millimeter really heavy duty poles that's going to keep your shelter working for many seasons for you. And then also the hub assemblies are also heavy duty and are going to wear well for you. One thing to consider when deciding between the thermal and the non-thermal C-Series is, as you can see, with this fabric, it is insulated and you're not gonna have that condensation that's gonna be dripping down as it's cold on the outside and warm on the inside. So the, the thermal shacks are really gonna keep you comfortable and dry, where if it's really cold outside, that non-thermal shack is probably going to form condensation you can have dripping uh, while you're fishing. So those are things to consider as you choose your clam hub shack. All right, now we're gonna talk about the X-Series the most extreme series, top of the line, hub shack that clam has. It's made for that extreme fishing, that extreme weather when it's really cold and it's built to stand up to whatever you throw at it. Let's go inside and check out some other great features. As I step into this shack, you can see how durable it's built. It's got 11 millimeter poles, flex tested, and the biggest hub assembly on the market. That's gonna keep those things together in those colder situations and make it you know durable and safe for you now let's just talk about the three different sizes of the x series there's the 400 the 500 and the 600 and the difference between those is size but the 400 is a four-sided check the 500 is a five-sided check and the 600 is a six-sided check um, this is great for fishing with friends or family especially family because we have a flooring for everyone at all three of these size checks or, so your kids are up off the ice and dry. But some other cool features is the netting up here. This is where I store my jacket, my gloves, my stuff like that. It's a little warmer up here, so it keeps it warm when you get out and put your jacket on. It's nice and toasty for you. Another thing is I like this pocket down here. This is where I keep my phone. I can see if I want to answer it or not. Um, you can see through the meshing. It's safe in there, and um, you know you don't have to worry about it going down the hole. So with all these cool features and, and everything, this is a perfect shack for friends and family to get out fishing and have fun. Now that we've given you an overview of the C-Series and X-Series hubs from Clam, we'll show you how to take down the hub shelters. First thing you want to do is come and undo your strap and then put this in the handy pocket that is provided. Remember to take out your ice cleat, tie down. And now we're gonna show you how easy it is to put one of these things up. One thing I like to do is close all the windows and doors so there's nothing that can get caught. But the first thing I'm gonna do is come in here and pull the top down. As soon as I get that top down, I'm gonna come out here Pull this off here and close this door. As soon as I get that done, Kristen's going to push from the other side at the same time. We're going to let a little air out. And we're going to walk across to the opposite side again. And go ahead and push that end in. And then you just flip it over like this. And pull it together. Put the strap on and throw it in the bag. So that gives you a really good overview of the C-Series and X-Series hubs from Clam. Remember, the C-Series is a great budget-friendly option for anglers with families or anglers that like to get on the ice occasionally. And as a guide and a hardcore angler, the X-Series is built for me. One that's rugged and tough and it'll handle all different types of conditions. Now that we've gone through all the features of the X-Series and C-Series, you can decide which shack works best for you.